When a family is heartbroken, a wife is traumatized after a man was shoved in front of a moving subway train. This morning, police will be handing out flyers to try to find the person responsible. It happened at Grand Concourse on 167th Street Station in Highbridge. Eyewitness News reporter Lisa Caligrassi is there live this morning. Good morning, Lisa. Good morning, Ken, and there are already a lot of flyers out here. This crime has really struck a nerve. Take a look here. These are reward flyers that the police put up yesterday, really surrounding this neighborhood around the 167th Street Grand Concourse subway station. An absolutely horrific crime. Now, we want to take a look at this surveillance video once again. According to police, it shows the man the believed to be the suspect in this case casually smoking a cigarette moments before he pushes a man to his death in the path of an oncoming D train. The death of 61-year-old Wa Hoon Kwok played out in front of his horrified wife who only speaks a few words of English. Now, police believe the man was a complete stranger and the attack was unprovoked. It shattered a sleepy Sunday morning for strap hangers. The MTA workers was in between them said, I can't believe somebody got pushed in front of the train and they were really panicking. Absolutely terrible. I hope they catch him, whoever he is. Now here's another look at the subway station where this happened yesterday morning. Detectives believe that this suspect likely lives in this neighborhood and they're hoping that other residents will recognize him and contact police. For now, we're live in the high bridge section of the Bronx. Lisa Calabrasi, Channel 7 Eyewitness News.